Today's U.S. military finds itself at a historical inflection point as trends across the diplomatic, information, military, and economic spheres rapidly transform all aspects of society, including future warfare. As we consider the character of future war, we can address it in two stages. The era of accelerated human progress, where our enemies use evolutionary technologies to challenge our forces. And the era of contested equality, where revolutionary technologies can dramatically change the character of warfare. Our understanding of the future OE must be continuously informed by analyses of the trends that shape the future. There are 12 trends we are tracking to stay ahead of the curve. All of these trends are constantly evolving, but are crucial to our understanding of the future OE. Robotics, unmanned systems with some degree of autonomy. Power generation and storage that is more efficient and economical. Technology, engineering, and manufacturing that delivers tailored on-demand products. Collective intelligence that leverages social media platforms. Increased level of human performance with physical and cognitive enhancements. Human-computer interaction that increases efficiency. Cyber and space that have emerged as warfighting domains. Artificial intelligence that enables more effective decision-making. Big data, an increasingly vital source of information and intelligence. Climate change and resource competition that increases the potential for conflict. Economic rebalancing and income disparity foster discontent and instability. Demographics and urbanization are changing the social and physical context of the future battlefield. Among these trends, we see the emergence of a myriad of new and advanced technologies. The future OE will be marked by an array of threats from these continually developing new technologies. Prospective adversaries in the era of accelerated human progress are the so-called 4 plus 1. Russia is currently our most capable potential foe. China is rapidly developing the capabilities to become our pacing threat by 2035. North Korea is a nuclear power with conventional capabilities that make it a significant regional threat. Iran is a regional hegemon with asymmetric capabilities. Beyond these nation states are radical ideologues that present an enduring threat. Future warfare in the era of accelerated human progress will be characterized by hybrid threats, contested domains, weapons of mass effects, operations in urban and complex terrain, and an increased momentum of human interaction. We are already seeing game-changing evolutionary technologies that can provide a decisive edge over an adversary. These include robotics, which will change society and labor markets that will impact the character of war. Space-based capabilities will threaten reliable PNT, ISR, and communication networks. Computing power will increase exponentially and be essential to analyze big data and leverage the Internet of Things. Artificial intelligence that enables manned, unmanned teaming for both mental and physical tasks. Adaptive manufacturing will be a boon to logistics but may not result in demand reduction. In the era of contested equality, norms will be contested and disorder will persist. Trends will interact to create new conditions for competition and conflict, creating new rivalries and unanticipated adversaries. In this era, we can expect revolutionary technologies such as synthetic biology, with the potential for weaponization of biological entities, swarms of semi-autonomous, massed, coordinated, fast, and collaborative small robots, energetics that will revolutionize the storage and usage of explosive energy, directed energy weapons such as lasers and RF weapons that will provide both lethal and non-lethal effects, hypervelocity weapons that will have the speed and energy to defeat countermeasures. The convergence phenomenon occurs as technologies are blended in a myriad of ways with unpredictable and potentially catastrophic results. These results will have an effect on warfare as dramatic as the convergence of messaging, gaming, computing, and internet access that the smartphone had on society. Future conflict will be waged through all domains, and our ability to integrate power across those domains will be critical to successful operations in contested environments. Our challenge is to recognize the enduring continuities for the future while continuing the analyses necessary to anticipate changes to the character of warfare. Understanding the operational environment is the critical first step in developing the concepts and capabilities addressing the challenges of the future.
We must take advantage of advanced technologies and consider the dramatic increase in the speed of human interaction to adapt faster and maintain our ability to overmatch any potential adversary at the point of decision. Although the future we present here is not certain, the trends suggest that the character of warfare is changing. For the nation and the Army to succeed, we must quickly learn and adapt, laying the groundwork today for success in the future.